Hey guys, this is your buddy Rome. Today we're going to talk about something very interesting related to DJI, their drones, their controller. This is the RC2 controller that you guys see here. They have added a new feature to this controller, guys. Now we have a simulator. I have wanted a drone simulator for quite some time to be able to just practice sometimes without having to throw the drones up in the air. And I have looked, I'm a Mac user, just to be clear. So finding a good simulator has always been a challenge and something to control it with. Now it has been integrated into the RC controller. You can just click right here. Once you install, do the note, uh, the latest update, you'll be able to go right in here, click on the simulator. It will load for you. Now, so far, it only has one drone, and that drone is the uh, the newest drone that just came out. So if you want to take a look at your hangar, you can click here. It's going to show you that this is the DJI Mavic 4 Pro. That's the only drone that you can choose from. I'm hoping in the future other drones will be included with this as well. So from here, you can go through and do your basic course. So if you haven't done the basic course before, now there are some other uh, things that are going to be coming soon as you guys see here but the basic course is really really <laughs> basic um, you would just start that it's going to load it onto your controller and then you're going to go through your normal you know checks and everything so you can tap on the screen you can um, place the drone pretty much wherever you want to it takes a few seconds you can launch it just like you would uh, a normal drone it also walks you through all of the different settings like for instance switching from sport mode to uh, normal to cine mode and it'll let you know if you've done something right which is super cool as well and this is going to be great for people who are just starting out just got their first drone don't know how to fly the drones at all but they don't want to take the risk of putting the drone in the air no problem we can spool up the drone just like you would a real drone now you're able to also go through and it's gonna walk you through everything. So now we're gonna take off and it gives you the indicator. Okay, now we're good. We have our little arrow right there and then it'll give you your next uh, task and that might be moving the drone from one location to another. So in this case, we're gonna be moving the drone forward. So we're just gonna use that stick and we're gonna push this guy forward. And then it's going to give you your next task and it just goes on and on and on like this for the basic components just to get you started learning how to maneuver the drone in somewhat 3d space so now we can move the drone to the left and then it's going to have you take the drone back to the right gives you very simple instructions i'm telling you guys this may seem very rudimentary to a lot of us who've been flying for a while, especially those of us that are using drones commercially. But remember what it was like when you first flew your first drone and you had no idea, you know, what was going on, what to expect. This makes it so easy for a lot of people, guys. All right, so we're going to pan around back to your center point. And you're pretty much good. So at this point now, you can kind of fly around the environment. You have your map down here at the bottom. It has these little rings that you can fly through, which is kind of cool, almost like a video game. So let's say if you started off flying, it gives you the little target. You can kind of adjust it so that you can fly straight through without hitting anything. And then you can just keep going. I went a little bit off track, but you guys get it. I'm trying to record this video and fly this at the same time. So we could go through all of these. You could follow the course the way it's laid out or to the best of your ability, however you would do it. So you guys get the idea. So we're just going to fly right through this guy here. And let's bring it back around. Let's go ahead and go move forward. And we can bring it around at the same time. showing off my skills here and just like that so things like this is going to make this so much easier give a lot of people confidence yes you can go in and adjust the camera angles i mean the uh, distance of the cameras 
It has simulation here. You can also change it from photo to video mode. You have a lot of those, you know, single, normal, all of those things are right here as well. So you got a lot that you can do with this little controller. So anyway, as I said, guys, I wanted to just show you guys this really quick, you know, so you guys could see uh, one of the new features that DJI has brought to us. So definitely check this out. If you have the RC controller, this is going to be a win. It's going to be a win for you guys. So definitely check it out. There's a lot more to it. Of course, you can use your camera control so you can tilt down and you can still advance forward if you want to. Now, like I said, you're gonna go through this basic setup. Once you have this basic setup done, then you'll be able to go back out. You can exit here, and then you can go into this flight mode here, which is gonna allow you to pretty much fly around this little city. So you can do a lot of cool things there. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and place our drone. And then we're gonna go ahead and put this guy right here. And we're going to spool it up and quickly we're going to just go up and then from here we can fly out. We can bring that camera down, maybe want to look at the roof a little bit, maybe want to take the drone up higher so you can get above some of the terrain or these buildings. It does have the obstacle avoidance uh, enabled on this simulator as well. So you got a lot of flexibility here, guys. This is gonna be great for practicing, you know, some of your maneuvers, things like that. And you even have a return to home. So if I press and hold the return to home, you're gonna get a simulation to the return to home, which is kind of cool. But yeah, I would like to thank DJI for including this in the most recent update. I think you guys are gonna love this. I'm gonna be playing with this thing all the time. Probably gonna run the battery down on my controller every single day. And I can't wait until they unlock even more features with this simulator. All right, guys, this has been your buddy Rome with Rome Knows Tech, and I will catch you all in the next video. Until then, stay safe, peace, let's let it land. And just like that, I'm out.